So I got this lovely comment saying, do Rosella and Hazel. And for some reason, I felt obliged to fulfill this request. I suppose it's just because I'm such a lovely person. I'm going to match this R with this L, and it's a bit of a sneaky trick. Just do an ordinary R, but keep the left side of it nice and short. That way, when you turn it over, you can kind of ignore it. Next up, an O and an E, which is also very simple. Now we've got a Z, which needs to make a Z upside down, and I'm sure that eagle-eyed among you will already have spotted that a Z is already a Z upside down. Next, I'm going to match the E and the L to become the A. And it's going to be a nice curvy E, as you can see. E and L with the cross path the E touching makes an A upside down. Isn't that clever? Finally, I now have to match the L and the A to make the H make it very long because it has to be a capital H upside down. But to make an A, you just have to add this stroke here. Rosella and Hazel. I hope you enjoyed it. Peace.